Hi, this is a window string thingy that I am currently hating because, well, I'm not hating this. I'm hating the sun because it is making my face all like stripey. Hey guys, okay. So here's the look I have for you, and since the sun is being so stupid, you probably can't see much of it. But um, if you can, that's what it looks like. And then some bright neon colors. And then I have a coral lip, which is great for spring, even though it's not very spring in Wisconsin. It's kind of still winter. But I'm just going to get started with the tutorial, and I'm sorry about the lighting. So I'm just going to start off with a white base. I use this in like every tutorial that I want to make the colors pop with. So I already have my primer on, and I'm just putting this all over my eyelid, dragging it into the inner corner, and then also putting it under my brow bone so I have a highlight there. I'm not going to use an extra highlight color. First color is going to be like this um, green right here that you can see. And it's pretty bright and I'm just using a flat brush, one side of a flat brush. Now I'm going to put that in the inner corner. And I'm also going to like blend it towards the middle of my lid. Just packing the color on there. Now with the other side of my brush, um, I'm going to take this yellow color right here, which is right there, and I'm going to put that in the middle of my lid, just dabbing the color on there, blending it into the green. Okay, I'm going to take the other side of my brush, or just another flat brush, if you want, and I'm putting this orange right there, this one, in my outer corner. And it's not like the outer V, I'm just putting this in the outer corner. <laughs> or like the inner, outer half. Outer third. Yeah. Now I'm going in with a color like this. It's really unique, I think. And you barely need any of it. I'm choosing the red here. Then I'm taking a fluffy brush like this. And then you can see that there's like so much on here. And I barely had to do anything to get that, and then I have a lot of fallout. Okay, so make sure you tap off the excess. This um, color is from Inglot, just by the way. So it's pretty, like, pretty pigmented. So I'm taking that red, and I'm putting it into my crease. Okay, it looks a lot better on this side, but, yeah. So I'm just going to fix that up real quick with some, um, some like, white or skin-toned matte eyeshadow. Eyeliner, I'm going to take a black and I'm lighting my top lash line with it. Staying pretty close to the lash line. Then for my waterline, I'm going to do a fun color, this blue. Okay, now I'm going to put on my mascara. The sunlight is like really bothering me. Sorry if it's like bothering you too. Um, then I already put on my cheek. Hold on, I'm going to close this curtain. I'm moving like this way so that won't happen. Alright, okay, so... I already put on a mineralized skin finish in petticoat. Um, like kind of just all over my face, but mainly focusing on the cheeks. And then I have on Ever Hip lipstick, which is a coral. And um, Christine from Temptalia.com said that like it was like she hadn't seen like a dupe for it. So this is pretty unique, and it's from the Fashion Flower Collection. So yeah, it's Ever Hip. What is going on with the sun? Okay. Yeah, I'll just put some more on. <laughs> more on. <laughs> yeah, so this look was just like a fun, tropical, bright, electric look. And um, I hope you guys liked it. I'm just doing one last close look. So that is all, and I will see you guys later. Bye.